Hey everyone, this is your self-portrait flat lay instructions. The first thing you're going to do is fill out this planning sheet. You're going to read through these prompts on the left and type your answers on the right. So you've each got a copy of this in the classroom assignment. So you're going to think about these things before you start. Uh, fill it in and then you will attach it to your assignment. The next part is to actually take your flat lay and you can use your cell phone to take your picture. You can use um, your Chromebook even if your cell phone camera is not working. You can use a real camera if you have the ability to take the memory card and uh, place those photos onto your Google Drive or uh, email them to yourself or something like that. So as long as you can get the picture taken. Um, you'll be able to finish this assignment. Now, if you run into any trouble at all, you can send me a message, you can um, send me an email, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can, okay? Uh, the next part is after you've taken your photo and you're really happy with it, then you're gonna open the self-portrait flat lay slide that I attached to your assignment. And in that slide, there is a mock Instagram post. Generally, we see things like flat lays on Instagram because it's a photo sharing website. So one of our biggest social media platforms. So it has a couple of things. It has a picture already inserted where your picture will go. It has a light blue text box for you to add your name. So you're just going to replace that with your name. And it has a light blue text box down here at the bottom for you to add a brief description of your image. You can tell me a little bit about you. You can tell me what about about what's in the photo. This is up to you what your description is. I gave the reminder down here about how to replace the hiker image with yours, but all you have to do is click this image and then you get some tools up here appear. And you're going to click replace image and then you'll choose one of these. If it's in your Google Photos, you can click Photos. If you uploaded it to Drive from your phone, you can click Drive. And if you want to upload from your computer, you click that if you have it saved on your Chromebook, which if you took the picture with your Chromebook camera, um, it would be on upload from computer or drive maybe. Uh, so you would just click drive, for example, go to your drive and then find your picture and it will replace this image with the one that you choose. Okay, that's it. And once you're all finished, you're gonna make sure that that is um, submitted correctly on Classroom, which since I'm giving you each a copy, it should automatically go ahead and finish that. Just make sure that you turn it in. Okay, I can't wait to see them.